big win over <laughs> big tie against Minnesota on Saturday night. Um, what's the emotional level like for the team right now? Well, I mean, I think our guys were pretty excited. Number one, uh, you know, to play well against uh, the number one team in the country and find a way to get the extra point at home. Uh, emotional weekend with our seniors. So there was a lot of positives that came out of it. But I think the, the one that was the most positive was our team got better on Saturday night. As the game went on, we kept getting better and better. And I, you know, I think we realized that, you know, what we need to do to play against top teams like that. So I think that was really important. But we also know we're going into a tough building against a team that's beaten Michigan twice. Uh, they just lost in overtime to Wisconsin. Uh, they lost in a shootout to Michigan State. They, I mean, they've played everybody very well. This is a very, very good hockey team we're playing this weekend, and we just talked about that just now. You talked about getting better. Did you feel like maybe your team maybe had, had plateaued for a while then and it wasn't getting better each weekend? Well, I don't know if we plateaued. I just think we were kind of up and down a little bit, you know, and that almost was period to period or, you know, half a period to half a period. You saw our team at times. One period we were, you know, give up a couple power play goals in Michigan, and all of a sudden we got our jump back, but we were down two goals. So the consistency thing, I think, is the number one thing. Um, you know, I think we've gotten better in, in areas for sure, but overall we got to be consistent down the stretch in playoffs, you know, to have a chance. The offense has struggled for a while. Can you put your finger on what that issue is? Big Ten Conference. Um, you look at the goaltenders in our league, and you look at the average of goal scoring in our league, and I think we're, we're still one of the top teams, and we're averaging two goals a game. Um, you know, so you look at the goal scoring up and down through the six teams, and I think that could be said for everybody. So, um, you know, we've put up a lot of numbers this year, and we've scored some goals, but at the same time, um, you know, this league's just so good defensively and also special teams. You know, if we're not scoring on the power play, that goals per game is going to come down a bit. What are the challenges going to a place that, that nobody's been to before? I mean, you, you know, been to Minnesota, been to Wisconsin in the past. Um, obviously the other Big Ten schools, CCHA schools. Um, yep. What's it like going to Penn State for the first time? What are the challenges? Well, first, uh, hopefully we all the guys get their phones out and take pictures when we get there on Thursday. It seems we've had that going to Minnesota this year, you know, going to Wisconsin, which was a first for those two. You know, we're going down there. We're playing on senior weekend in a building we haven't been to. Uh, we're going to have our hands full to start, and it's kind of like you got to get your feet wet, and hopefully those first five minutes we can hold our own to, to a team that's going to play awfully hard. Um, so there's challenges, but yet it's exciting too. I mean, I think our guys understand it's playoff time no matter where we go. Um, so the rink's the same as far as the size of the sheet as we are here. So uh, kind of like the old Hoosier thing. Hey, we're going down there to play. It's the same rink. It's not an NHL or uh, Olympic size sheet. So let's just get used to the crowd, get used to the building and practice and be ready to go for the game.